transition been coming back from injury? Uh, it's been really smooth, honestly, because I'd already started practicing a little bit right before season ended, so getting back into the court was a really smooth transition, especially being able to do the whole beach season. Where are you at from a confidence and comfort standpoint in terms of being 100%? Yeah, I'm pretty much all the way there. I'm feeling really good. My vertical's still a work in progress. It's coming back and getting higher every week. You know, I didn't do like actual floor jumping in about five months, so it was a little weird for a little while, but it's getting higher every week. What are your, what are your personal goals? What are you focused on this, this spring? Uh, I've been putting a really big number on my serving and passing, so it's been something I've been really working on. And then, you know, we do a lot of defensive work in the spring season just to get um, new players acclimated to our system because, you know, like we pride ourselves on our defense. So when it comes to, like, backcourt defense and blocking, you know, we always put a big premium on that. Coach Cook's been pretty impressed with the freshman group. What are your, what's your assessment so far? Yeah, they're really great to be around. You know, they're really good. They kind of blended in right away. Um, they're really great girls. They've got great personalities, and they just fit in right there. Um, they're a little bit quieter than us, so we got them a little bit out of their comfort zone, especially with volleyball. Um, but they're great, and they're really fun to be around. John said Skyler's taken out some people on the left side with their swings. Have you, have you been a victim of one of Skyler's swings yet? Or yes, Coach, or not Coach. She hit me in the stomach the other day at practice. Uh, it was like an off-blocker ball. She got me right in the gut. It was a good one. I had to take I had to take a breather for a, for a second, and then I was all good. But yeah, she's got some great swings. Big sell up for the uh, spring match and those early tickets in Carney. Just yeah. you know, just can you tell me about your excitement about getting the spring match going and seeing those tickets continue to fly off whenever they're posted? Yeah, I mean it's really crazy that you can get uh, that many people wanting to show up for ticket sales like that you know like you expect that stuff for like an online ticket sale but you know when you have to have people like driving and like staying overnight to you know buy tickets to one of our spring matches uh, that's just another example of the devotion that people have to our team and our program and our university you were part of a Nebraska spring clinic uh, a couple like, last week last weekend mm -hmm. um, you were hosting the, uh, I called it the therapy session with Lindsay. Yeah. You were kind of sitting around with the girls. Can yeah. you just tell me what some of the conversations were and what it was like to connect with younger up and coming yeah. volleyball players? Yeah, so I wanted to open a circle and just kind of have like a short little like Q&A session for them because um, like I think it's really fun. I think a lot of them, a lot of the reason they go is just because they want to be around, you know, the Husker group. So, I mean, the young, the older girls who were like eighth grade would, you know, ask questions about volleyball and how do you... Um, not getting your head and what's practice like and then the younger girls would ask me like the eight-year-olds would ask me like what's your favorite color what's your mom's name like what's your favorite song you know stuff like that and it's just really fun for them because um, no matter what questions they're asking they're usually getting excited about it because they just want to hear my answer they don't really care um, the questions that they're asking so it, it was really fun is it cool for you to step into that role as kind of like a coach and yeah talk with those and it's, it's really fun to get them out of their comfort zone and just getting them talking you know and like talking about stuff that's not even necessarily about volleyball because I wanted each of them to like ask a question because sometimes girls will come to camps like that especially the younger ones and you know not talk to anybody not know anybody so getting them out of their comfort zone just to you know speak and say something is always really good for them how much have you gotten a chance to just reflect on last season how it ended for yeah. you personally for yeah. the team and how you try to flip the page yeah I talked a lot with my coaches going to this uh, spring season just talking about how I think it has really set in for me that it is my senior year and just how excited I am to go into it knowing that it's my season of last and you know um, having to go through that injury and sit out so much was um, really eye-opening for me and realizing how much I can take in and really enjoy and appreciate where I'm at. So, you know, I come to practice every day just really happy to be here and excited to do everything. So I think it really helped me kind of like reassess where I was at and understand my feelings toward the game. Final questions? Besides the physical aspect, is, is, it, is there a mental block just like how the injury happened, getting over that, and getting kind of getting ready to be amongst bodies at the net too. Is there a hurdle that you have to clear? There was at first, la uh, right when the season ended, because I was I was pretty cleared to like participate in most practice drills, but you know not cleared to play in a game. So uh, there was a big mental block last season, but I mean now that we've been playing a lot and. I typically tape my ankle regardless on if we're all taped, I'll tape it just and that gives me, you know, some mental support. But overall it's been really good and I've not really struggled with that so far. You've been up to a couple supernovas games. What's your impression of what they got going on up there? Yeah, it's it's really fun to go out there and support. Um, I think it's crazy. Uh, the amount of people that we can get at those games. I was at their uh, season opener, like the very first match that they had back in February, and to get like eleven thousand people out there, it was, you know, really cool. It just shows all the Nebraska fans that we have. Just Fans of volleyball, not even of a specific team. Yeah. Awesome. All right, thanks, Lindsay. Thank you. Thank thanks, you. Lindsay.